I want to read you something. I'm working, Marcella. Dear former gross pointers, can you believe it's been ten years already? Don't tease me, you know what I do for a living. I honestly don't know what I have in common with these people anymore. What am I gonna say? I killed the president of Paraguay with a fork? How have you been? Go see some old friends. Have some punch. Visit with what's her name? You mean Debbie. Just don't kill anyone for a few days. See how that feels. I'll give it a shot. No, don't shoot anyone. Hey, uh, I'm a pet psychiatrist. I sell car insurance. I lead a weekend men's group. We specialize in ritual killings. Hey, I'm Martin, remember me? Oh, I know who you are. What I miss? Oh, what? You stood me up on prom night and vanished without a word? Um... Welcome home. So I'm putting together this little group. What, like a union? Yeah, one target. You're either with us, or you're against us. Welcome back, Pointers. You haven't changed a bit. <laughs> so what exactly do you do, Martin? I'm a professional killer. Do you have to do postgraduate work for that, or do you just jump right in? Get in! You're being targeted! There's a contract out on your life! But I'm not gonna do it. I'm either in love with your daughter, or found a newfound respect for life. That punk! He's either in love with the target's daughter, or he found a newfound respect for life. Debbie, I'm in love with you! I'm determined to make this relationship work! I can change! Why don't you just kill this target? You've killed hundreds before! Because! My identity transformation in literature yeah. created relevancy in modern life. What the fuck? I want you to think about this. You don't have to answer right now. Debbie, will you marry me? Need his name up in lights. He just wants to be heard. Whether it's the beat of the mic, he feels so unlike everybody else alone in spite of the fact.